Hello folks, Gary Rains with FDRA here to share our latest 90 second snapshot on the state of U.S. footwear demand. With consumer confidence high and unemployment low, overall retail sales naturally fared well in the latest month, growing a year over year 6.6% in June, the best showing since 2012. Shoe store sales also fared well, growing a year over year 4.2%, the fastest in about the last 21 months. In fact, sales grew to a seasonally adjusted record of $3.08 billion in May, a pronounced improvement from the tepid performance witnessed over most of the last year. But in spite of the May spurt, year-to-date shoe store sales still are lower versus the same first five months of 2017, suggesting that eh, four-year sales will likely turn flat to lower, possibly shrinking for only the fourth time in the last quarter century. Now, historically, year-to-date increases and declines in sales often foreshadowed a similar full-year sales trends. The modest drop in year-to-date shoe store sales witnessed here in 2018 uh, suggests a similar tepid performance this year also. Now, stepping back a moment, we compare shoe store sales to consumer spending on footwear, a broader measure of footwear demand across all channels. Given uh, over the, the last year, a, a pronounced divergence has uh, erupted between the two, suggesting footwear demand at ret retailers other than shoe stores, that is, big box retailers, online, department stores, and the like, have been faring better than at shoe stores in recent months. But we see that divergence closed in May as shoe store sales grew appreciably faster. Growth in footwear spending also expanded to a record in May, reaching a seasonally adjusted annualized $81.8 billion. Like the snapshot, we publish insights into issues across the footwear supply chain at FDRA.org. We encourage you to have a look there at how we can help you produce, distribute, and sell footwear more effectively and profitably. Thank you.